Introducing the KT3 impeller from Lightning, an impeller that provides the necessary mixing at low tank levels to allow tank contents to drain without settling of solids. This shows a tank with a shallow cone bottom and an outlet at the center of the cone. Although the KT3 is shown in a tank with a cone bottom, it is also designed to operate with a dished tank bottom. The KT3 is placed underneath the main impeller at close clearance to the tank bottom. The KT3 does not suspend solids, but rather creates an asymmetric flow pattern in the bottom head to prevent solids from settling at the bottom of the tank. This allows the solids to leave the tank and not plug the pump, which can occur if agitation is not maintained in the bottom of the tank. In the following side-by-side -side comparison, a 10% by weight gypsum slurry is drained out of an agitated 17.5 inch diameter tank with a dished bottom and three wall baffles. The main impeller is a 6.8 inch A310 and the lower impeller is a 3.5 inch KT3. The upper left video shows a tank draining with the A310 and the KT3 installed, whereas the lower right video shows the tank draining with only the A310 operating. As the slurry drains, the A310 becomes less effective at providing the necessary mixing to keep the solids off the bottom of the tank. Once the A310 is exposed, no mixing occurs in the lower right video. However, in the upper left video where the KT3 is installed, you can see the asymmetric flow pattern developing. This sweeps the tank floor and allows the solids to exit. Once both mixers are stopped, you will notice all of the solids have exited the tank with the KT3 installed, and all of the solids remain in the tank without the KT3. In a full-scale installation, solids can easily plug up the pump outlet, causing unwanted downtime and lost production. The KT3 Impeller, a new mixing solution from Lightning, an SPX brand. To learn more about the KT3, please contact your sales representative or come visit us at our website.